Welcome back awesome Action Toy fans and subscribers. Something a little bit different for me today. This is by Creative Field, never heard of them. Uh, they, this is called Number 57 Armored, Armored Puppet Industry Type 3. Uh, it's a kit, I think, 147 parts, it says. And it says it's 124 scale. Now, I bought this because on the picture I saw, the guy had it in his hand, and it looked like it was uh, uh, compatible with 118. So, I'll have a look at that in a moment and see if it is, and I can confirm, really confirm it is a kit. Having just seen that picture on the side there, he does look really, really cool. So, I am really hoping that he is going to be compatible with 118. So he seems to have some decent articulation for a kit as well. Uh, it says core body and then the mechanical arm stretch. What's that? There were little claw things on there. Uh, it's got unlimited base. Not sure that's included in this. Another close up picture there with the, I guess, the armor type or armor part on top of the core body. I'll show that again. So this is the core body, just the black there and then with the added parts. In fact, I hope it's all inside. I hope it's just not the armor parts and no core body. That like, mm. <laughs> but 147 parts, which I'm not going to build on camera. I'll do it off camera so you guys don't get bored. Uh, let's see what it's like. So some clear parts there. We've got a box. Oh yes. This is, de well, this should be 118 scale compatible confirmed because those hands are 118 scale hands if I've ever seen 118 scale hands I've seen a lot of 118 scale hands so that should be pretty cool and just bags and bags of parts uh, so this is oh it does come with that little base section as well that's pretty cool this is going to take me qu quite a while to while to build it does have a nice instruction booklet with more pictures on and i will have a quick flick through this and show you so you guys can see well it looks like it's the same picture just bigger but that does look good well, that looks like something really really quite cool okay so i am gonna start building this and if I don't finish it today, I'll finish it tomorrow. Then I'll complete the video and post it and let you guys see and have a look. If I like it, I might get another one. It wasn't that expensive. I'm trying to think how much it was. Um, in pound, it was under eight pound. So maybe seven pound or something. I'll, I'll look it up and I'll tell you when I come back with the completed or the next step of the uh, building process. Okay. So I'll be back soon with this built or in the process of being built. Stay tuned. So I'm a few minutes in and his body is, the basic body's done, but he's looking not 118, he is looking very much like the 124, so he may be compatible with the uh, B25 Acid Rainbow stuff, which is one, 128 scale. However, I was right about the hands. The hands do look, the, in fact, the hands are 118 scale, so... This will be interesting, so his body's pretty cool, he's got some simple articulation and instructions are really easy to follow, but you will need your sharp knife or clippers, yes, my same blue knife, so this is going to be really cool. Okay, I'll be back when it's finished or another update, yeah, well, instantaneously for you, but in a few more minutes or, or whatnot for me, okay, back soon. Okay, so the basic body is built, his hands are Still look 118 to me, maybe I just misjudged, but he is perfect if you're into the uh, the 124 Joy Toy. This is the basic body, and he's got awesome articulation. Now bear in mind, when I put the other parts on, he's going to have some different colours, some yellow, some grey, some clear, so he'll pop a bit more. So that looks articulation, so head, he looks a left and a right. He has a down and an up, and he can get a small... Can he? Yeah, yeah, a small side to side. Shoulders, he only gets up to the flat. Um, bicep bend, over 90 degrees. 
Choing. And then wrist is a ball, so it will turn and have small or quite a big motion inwards actually. And small motion in the other directions. Waist he can turn, he can tilt forwards from the abs as well. Hips he gets full splits on the sideways. Forwards not quite, backwards not quite, but still pretty good. Here's kneecap bend. Single kneecap, but look at that. That is as tight as it can get. And then his ankle is on a ball, so we have up and down. He gets a decent tippy toes. His uh, dorsal flexation is insane. Look at that. Here's Michael Jackson. And obviously he has a tilt because it's on the ball for side to side. So even his legs are wide, he can still get a, a flat foot, flat feet on the ground. Very impressive. This, I like this a lot. This is a fantastic kit. But honestly, I think it'd be better to uh, get it, paint it, and stick it together. Because you want to paint it when it's uh, stuck together. It might be a bit difficult in place. Let me just shave these little uh, spurs off from here and here. And it didn't take that long to build him. It took, what, maybe 20 minutes? So not long at all. Okay, uh, he also has a bicep swivel, I should tell you as well. So, if I do a little comparison, if I use a, somewhere, here we go, I've got Acid Rain Weld uh, Corsac Marksman. You can see he's way too small for the 118. Now, if I show you the hands, was I right or was I wrong? It's almost the same size on the hands. So his hands are a little large, but it does work for the 124. If I use him with a B25, which is a 128 scale, they can work together because it's a robot, but you see he's still big. But for the Joy Toy 124, I think it'd be perfect. I think it'd be perfect. Okay, so. I'm going to continue doing the rest of him, and then I'm going to come back when he's done and show you guys, okay? So, I'll be back, if not later today, the finishing it, I'll finish it tomorrow and I'll show you guys, okay? So, back in a moment. Okay, here he is. Uh, <laughs> he looks awesome. It's worth noting, with these other stuff, you actually have to take off his arms, and you have to take off his feet, his head part of his uh, back, chest, and part of his um, pelvis pieces. But he looks amazing, such a cool figure. And he still has great articulation. You can see that by bending the arm, it's still slightly over 90, not as good. Obviously now he has this claw hand, which does go together, and it does go apart which is really really nice uh it still has his waist turn bar it still has his crunch there's slightly less movement in the head hips will be the same outwards forwards are slightly less backwards shouldn't be any more but just because i knocked a piece off let me put this piece back on uh backwards is the same but if you take that piece off, it'll go further. Uh, knees are the same because there's nothing that's going to stop there. Apart from the foot, actually. But it doesn't make a difference on this. And his feet are different feet. They're slightly bigger. And he balances very, very nicely. Um, one really cool thing is these arms are Constantina. So if you see his arm here, brr, he can go... Brr, like this on both sides it is really brrr, extendable extended arms which is really a cool feature kind of like a power loader from from aliens okay let me fold those back up and then i'm going to look at a couple of things of him so he is 124 a real 124 not a big robot that's in 124 so it scales with 118 
if that made sense. So with the Corsac Marksman, you can see he's going to be too small, unless it's like a puppet for 118. If I get a B25 again, that does work for B25. Now what's really good is if I get the Beaver, I'm going to be suggesting videos, he matches so well with that. Really, really matches well. He can climb on, he can get these action poses. He's a great match with the beaver. His, his yellow is a darker, more of a egg yolk yellow, a dark egg yolk yellow compared to the actual B25 beaver, which again is an awesome, awesome toy. Another great thing about him is that I said he comes with a couple of dio pieces. So you get this little dio piece here and you get this piece here. It also gives you extra connectors. So if you've got more of these, you can put them together. Um, corner pieces to somehow do it differently. But there's no instructions on those. Uh, uh, it gives you some extra tiny joints, which you can just about see here, which is good because those are so easy to lose. And more dio pieces and connectors again. And then the new parts I added to them from the basics, it also gives you all of those in clear plastic as well. So you can mix and match and make your own sort of combination. But I think it looks great in this yellow, grey, yellow, light grey and very, very dark grey. You weather that up very easily. He'll look fantastic. This is a really nice toy. And I, I just had a quick look at what I paid. With delivery, is about £8.54p. Bargain. Really, really nice. Great articulations of kits, it will, you know, take you probably around about an hour in total to assemble, maybe less, maybe more depending on your speed. You will need a knife and I would suggest that you have some tweezers handy in case, well, some of the, those little bits I just showed you, they're quite hard to put in. But really, really great toy. I'm so happy I got this. I might get another effect. I'm going to look up this... Um, what are they called this creative field and see what other stuff and kits they do again if you're into the joy toy 124 fantastic if you're into acid rain the b25 again it's fantastic really really good i just can't stop raving about how nice this is and with these uh dio panels here they are double sided so you can change the way you want your dio piece to look and of course you can if you extend out, you can get a nice corridor. You could probably do, have a quick look. You could do corners as well, because you do have, can you do corners? I think you can. I think, you, I'm on, oh, wait, wait, what's that one there? Yep, you've got corner pieces here. So these two pieces here. So you should be able to do corners as well for nice dye displays. You need to paint it up and paint up this little thing which is two pieces. That'll look fantastic and that'll work with your 118 and with your smaller B25 as well. Very good set, really recommend it. Um, if I can find places to buy it from, I'll stick it in the description, you can, you can look there. Awesome, awesome toy. Okay, this is awesome action toys. I am signing out saying, please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll be back soon with more awesome action toy videos for you. Stay happy, keep collecting. Bye-bye.